Okay, a creative chicken coop in Idaho is out of this world. Check this out. A couple from Boise designed this <laughs> <laughs> UFO themed coop over the summer. I love this. They oh installed goodness, flashing the lights chicken. to give it a, spe a special outer space look. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. The inside is climate controlled so the chickens stay warm at night. Awesome. The couple say they did it to show their love for the extraterrestrial and they say they uh, also plan to add an automatic ramp to the coop. A video on Facebook of their creation has close to a million views and it should when the chicken comes out of there when it's like, hello, we, <laughs> we come in peace. <laughs> <laughs> that is hilarious. Oh Look my at that. Gosh. I See, love that aliens so are I nothing to be afraid of. I know, I want one. All right. <sighs> Here's a story to warm your heart on this chilly day. A soldier surprised his family, I love these, mm -hmm. after being gone for almost an entire year. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Staff Sergeant, along with his wife and other family members, surprised his four children with a homecoming visit in North Carolina. He left his pregnant wife and three kids 11 months ago to serve time in the Army's National Guard in Jordan. Uh, it's something that all the soldiers talk about is what, what you know, that homecoming moment. Um, it's a special moment. So it's definitely something that keeps you motivated throughout the tour. Mm, that little boy won't let him put him down. I can mm -hmm. see that. Aww. Well, coming home, he got the chance to meet his seven-month-old son for the very first time. Look at that. After the holidays, he plans to return to his job as a mortgage officer. Mm -hmm. And, of course, don't forget this weekend is Veterans Day. It's an opportunity for everyone to stop and honor America's heroes. And if you're able, come on downtown to the Virginia Veterans Parade to show your support, or you can tune in at home right here on WSLS 10 on Saturday starting at 11 a.m. I love those stories I so much. I always, too. I cannot help but tear up. I know it.